Hey guys, this is a update video of the 91 GSXR 750 and my friend's 2008 CBR 600RR. Um, for the last probably five days, it's been nothing but Bondo fiberglass, lots and lots of work, lots of sanding craziness. Um, finally, yesterday, finished the uh, sanding, got it super smooth and perfect, and threw on some 2K primer. I uh, just cleaned the garage now. Man, it was so dirty, so dusty and messy. The bikes are still all dusty, but yeah, anyway, um, here's all the parts here from the 91 GSXR. Uh, we customized the tail. Um, I fiberglassed and bonded in the solo so there's no seam. There used to be a seam here because this was a third piece. Um, I had no choice but to customize it. Somebody, the previous owner uh, cut it, the tail, and put a really crappy light in it. I got a new integrated light, but I don't know, this is kind of, you can kind of see, definitely looks better than it was, it'll look pretty cool for a 91. Um, here's our bikes, uh, my buddy ordered the HID lights, uh, we're just in the middle of figuring that out, really dusty, covered in dust, here's mine. got to figure out what color I want to paint my rims but the body should look pretty good it was just uh, when I got it, it was like black spray paint it was really scratched up and bad uh, the stock blinker holes were huge I covered them up because I got uh, I got some flush mount blinkers just little guys uh, little flush mount ones are close enough I'm gonna put those on and it did have, where are they? This was the ugly ass tail light that was on it. Huge, all dated. These blinkers are huge. They were hanging out the side. Now I got the integrated tail light. It's not the greatest, but it's a million times better than what was on the bike. It's gonna look cool. Um, uh, yeah, there it is there. Uh, the brake light's kind of like an upside down T and the blinkers are up in the corners. It's got the license plate light down here um, and the license plate bracket. Yeah, I'll be figuring all that out. Um, but yeah, that's the update for now. Um, I took pictures along the way of all the fiberglass and cutting and bondo steps and all that. I took pictures all the way through so once the bike's painted and back together I'll have a complete slideshow with illustrations from when I started sanding, started fiberglass and cutting, bondo, primer and through the paint steps. Should be a pretty cool slideshow. Anyway, that's the update. Catch you later. Bye.